We're here for Race 5 of the Reebok Cup Series Season 2, the regular season finale at Richmond, the Toyota Owners 400. Now let's take a look at your starting lineup. Starting off in row 1, we have the 15 car of Clint Boyer and the 18 car of Kyle Busch. Starting in row 2, we have the 17 of Ricky Stenhouse Jr. and the 11 of Denny Hamlin. Starting in row 3, we have the 2 of Brad Keselowski and the 16 of Greg Biffle. Starting off in row 4, we have the 48 of Jimmy Johnson and the 99 of Carl Edwards. Starting in row 5, we have the 88 of Dale Earnhardt Jr. and the 20 of Matt Kenseth. Rolling off in row 6, we have the 21 of Trevor Bain and the 1 of Jamie McMurray. Starting deep in the field at row 7, we have the 14 of Tony Stewart and the 9 of Marcos Ambrose. And rounding out the field, starting in row 8, we have the 5 car of Casey Kane. So the field's coming to the green flag. One race to go into the chase. We're green. Clint Boyer leads him down to turn 1, and Kyle Wish is going to pull past Stenhouse on the outside. Two car breakaway on the first time. We've got a crash already. Jimmy Johnson and Dale Jr. are involved. And we're going to go back underway on lap 3 now. Kozlowski looking to the inside of Bush. He's going to take second spot away. Hamlin also coming up there. Three laps to go. Carl Edwards right now has a one-point advantage over Kyle Busch for the chase. Lap five underway now. Denny Hamlin has moved into third, and there's a three-car breakaway now. Going on to lap six. Can Kozlowski get to the back bumper of the 15? Lap seven underway now. Kozlowski's going to make him with the lead. Oh, contact! And Hamlin's going to fly the lead on the outside. Halfway through this race. Lap 8, Denny Hamlin pulls away on board with Clint Boyer now. Boyer to his bumper. 8 laps complete here in Richmond. Now Edwards has a 5 point advantage on Kenseth. Kenseth is going to have some ground to make up here now as lap 10 is underway. Denny Hamlin still is your leader. Clint Boyer running in a close second. And we're going to go 3 wide for the lead. Kislasi is going to take the lead, but now Hamlin's going to take the lead back. And another 3 wide. 3 laps to go. And we've got a crash. Hard crash on the back edge. Casey Kane is flipping. Now let's take another look. Looks like going off the turn two here in the back of the field. Kane gets clipped and just goes upside down. Here's the points as they run. Greg Biffle is in the chase right now in third. Clint Boyer fourth with 47. And Edwards has a three-point lead on Matt Kenseth. The crowd is pumped. The drivers are ready. We're going Back underway here. Two laps to go at Richmond. The field sp spreads out. Now Kozlowski is going to go for second on Boyer. He's going to take it coming to the white flag. Boyer pulls a crossover. But Hamlin pulls away. Denny Hamlin is going to win. The Toyota F owners 400 at Richmond. Denny Hamlin brings home his first win of the season at Richmond. While locking himself in the chase. So Denny Hamlin wins. Clint Boyer ends up second. This he really needed this one. Kislowski comes third. He's been very consistent on the year and has two wins. Kyle Busch fourth, but I don't think he made this chase. Ricky Stenhouse Jr. ninth. Jamie McMurray tenth. Marcus Ambrose finishing eleventh. And not a real good day for Hendrick. There are three drivers finishing the bottom three in the st in the race. And the standings. Going into the chase, Brad Keselowski, Denny Hamlin, Greg Biffle, Clint Boy, and Carl Edwards made the chase. Matt Kenseth missed the chase by just two points above under Carl Edwards. Kyle Busch missed it by four. Stewart, he was in this chase until he got wrecked here. Marcus Ambrose, Watkins Glen, really hurt. I mean, he lost ten spots in the chase. And now he missed the chase. So here are your... Reebok Cup Series Season 2 Chase Drivers, Brad Keselowski, Denny Hamlin, Greg Biffle, Clint Boyer, and Carl Edwards.